Welcome back to Theme Park Wizard, and today we have some brand new images from the new Jurassic World Dark Ride from Beijing, which is using the same system as the ride system as the Amazing Adventures of Spider-Man, and Transformers, those motion-based vehicles. And of course, just starting off here with a figure that looks very familiar to those who have gone on Jurassic World and Universal Studios Hollywood. This is the Jurassic World, or sorry, the Indominus Rex, the same Indominus Rex figure that um, appears at the finale behind the bushes of um, Jurassic World and Universal Studios Hollywood. They ordered that couple of them built, so you built multiple, it's cheaper than just building one. It's awesome because when, the, when those lights are off, that Indominus Rex is going to look quite impressive. By the way, these pictures are from at Universal underscore core on Twitter. He does great Universal work. Let me go follow him. But yeah, uh, this uh, this in, uh, animatronic is super impressive in the Hollywood version, and the people in Beijing will be very impressed to see this. This might be at the finale or close to the finale of the attraction, um, like it is in Hollywood. Moving on, we have this... Uh, New, uh, this, uh, god, I forgot the name of this dinosaur. It's right on the tip of my tongue, but I'm gonna call him Bumpy because on Jurassic World, uh, Camp Crustaceous on Netflix, uh, Ben, or Benji, kind of adopts this dinosaur as his own little pet, and he calls him Bumpy. So I'm gonna call this dinosaur Bumpy or her Bumpy. And as she is, she's with her little babies on this rock. And uh, they'll probably be moving. And, oh yeah, they will be moving. You can see the little little pedestals on. So they'll be probably moving along. I'm not sure the plot of this attraction. Maybe it's like kind of like a jeep safari, or just roaming through Jurassic World, or I don't know why you're here. The first place maybe it's like a gyrosphere, but instead of a gyrosphere, you're in this um the motion based simulator thing. But yeah, they'll be exploring some dinosaurs, and of course, lastly. A statue of John Hammond. Look at this. The man who started on actually the same exact statue is in the new Jurassic World Tribute Store in Universal Studios, Florida. Again, building things, uh, building multiple of the same thing is cheaper than building just one. So that is nice. This looks like obviously not on the right itself, but maybe the queue or the exit queue or just like in the Discovery Center area because they, again, this is the first ground up Jurassic World land in the world and they have their own little Discovery Center area and this looks like it's probably right in the middle of that. What do you guys think of these cool new pictures of Jurassic World? Jurassic uh, uh, Universal Studios Beijing has soft opened in May. I'm not sure when the grand opening is and maybe later this month, but um, I'm super excited to see all the brand new rides. Uh, and in some cases, new rights seems to universal, like the suspended, uh, or, yeah, suspended powered coaster um, that's also in Jurassic World. So I'm very excited about that land and to see those new lands. And let me know in the comments below if you want me to do PBOV reactions to these rides when they start coming up online. I'll certainly be doing those if you guys want them, and I'll definitely be watching them. Do some breakdowns if you want. But what do you guys think of these cool new Jurassic World photos? Do you want a Jurassic World Dark Ride to come to Universal Studios or to come to Islands of, Islands of Adventure or Universal Studios Hollywood here in the States? Or do you want Universal Beijing to keep its um keep something kind of like iconic or you know exclusive to them for a little bit? Let me know in the comments below. Subscribe for more theme park updates. Like this video. If you like this video, press that thumbs up button. As always, have a fantastic day.